Welcome back. Now, for those of you who haven't decided on a costume yet, earlier on, we met Makeup Forever's Donna Morris Cullen, who began recreating the looks of Harlequin and the Joker from the movie Suicide Squad. And now, it's time for the big reveal. Donna is back. Let's see how she got on. Now, Mark came into studio. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Looking a particular <laughs> way. How is he looking now? Let's have a look and see Mark initially. So this was him when he came into us earlier on. And Donna, you were mentioning that you were going to use very little prosthetics, prosthesis, but there definitely you ornament the makeup. Wow. Yeah, 100%. I mean, I think the most um, special effects really is his brows. We've blocked out his brows. And that can be simply done with a little bit of um, spiracum. You okay. know, you brush up the brow in the direction of the growth and you glue them down. Really, really easy to do. And then you cover over with a little bit of powder and then you go back over with your foundation. Everything else is paint and foundation. Um, you know, we actually have added a little bit of tooth enamel as well on his teeth to make it look a little bit more. Even more frightening. Yeah, exactly. Oh, and um, we've actually used a small little bit of Artex, which is a special effects product again. It's a two-part silicone and it creates um, anything from burns to scars, anything you really want to do, and it sets really, really quickly. You've contoured as well, but in the most frightening way. <laughs> so tell us about the light and shade and people at home are trying to recreate the look. Yeah, 100%. It's really, really important. Um, basically, the centre of the face is where the light will naturally hit, so like that's where you want to target. And then along the contours, um, temples, cheeks, like under the jawline is really, really important to get as well for like a really nice chiselled uh, jawline. And yeah, down the, down the centre of the nose to get that um, highlight and contour effect, yeah, it's great. I think I need to ask Mark how he's feeling right now. Yeah. Mark, you can speak into this microphone. It's such a transformation. Mm. Is it, is it, what's it like with all that makeup on? It's so cool. I love the movie and I love the character. So to look in the mirror and see it, it's just so cool. Like, yeah, you don't mind wearing all that makeup and it wasn't sore or itchy or anything like that? No, it was actually, it was great getting it done. It was really gentle and it's just great. Yeah. Well, the thing is, we need to know, are you going out tonight? Come on, you can't do all this and then have to wash it all off. <laughs> of course you're I'm going out tonight. <laughs> Well, he sure, looks very all, like the character. All the girls are going to be dressed as Harley Quinn, so... <laughs> <laughs> so are, are you single then, obviously, yeah? Uh, no, actually not. <laughs> Okay, Lovely. very good. Well, I think I'd be dead scared if I opened my uh, <laughs> my front door to you. Um, and of course, we're going to take a look at Neve, who um, obviously looked very beautiful before and still looks beautiful mm -hmm. as Harlequin. And now that is an incredible transformation. My goodness, it's Donna. literally like a, a yeah. comic character yeah, coming to life. And like, I have to give Amy credit for this one. Like, she's amazing, and she's going to put like a really creative, different Brilliant. type Brilliant. of effect for Harlequin. She's added um, the the expression pudding across the neck it's a really um really popular phrase for harlequin and she's created stitches as well that's used with the yeah, artex that i used on the joker as well so it's really multi-purpose um like i mean it is a beautiful makeup but again it's turned into something really scary we added lashes a bit of blood and again a little bit of um, face paint to um apply the tattoo so you have um, a false eyelashes on, but you also have, and I hope the camera can pick it up, the eyeballs. So you have yes, the so you have the lenses. Yeah, again, they're so popular as well. Everyone comes in and asks, um, do we have them? And we do. And they're, they're amazing, like such an amazing uh, effect and a great finish to any costume. I'd love to have worn them today had I known. Yeah. I know. Can you actually see? I can see you. A little bit. It's a bit hazy, but you know, kind of blurry. But it's great. kind of blurry. Yeah. It's worth it. When no. you're wearing something like these costumes that are um, so out there, but so full of confidence, does it give you confidence? One hundred percent. Because I love, I love Harley Quinn. She's an amazing character. Like she's so full of energy. So yeah. it just gives you that boost. You, know, you, like, yeah. you like the movie? Did I you like Margot Robbie, Robbie in the movie? I love Margot Robbie. Oh. What I also like is the costume, which we haven't had a chance to even talk about. This is fantastic as well. Um, we love the, the hot pants. I don't know if I could dare go out looking like that. <laughs> yeah, and again, like the, the costume shop that I have been so good. Can you stand up just so everybody at home can see? Um, these are for cheese, cheese creatures if I've ever seen any. Um, but really and truly, this is the whole ensemble. It's a dead ringer for her. I love it. It's great. You can't wash your face all day now. Just till tomorrow. Yeah, no, I'm fine. not taking this off. I'm going as a witch. I'm going to say that I've seen that, Laura. I'm going as a witch. Yeah. Nah, nah, nah. Guys, thanks Brilliant. so much for coming <laughs> in today for being our models. Oh, thank and thank you so much, Donna, to yourself and your team. Yeah, absolutely <laughs> fantastic. It's a great inspo yeah. there. Um,